aside from like it's a uh, cooper cooperative of online providing as proposed by um, BJP trainers and graduates and also um, renowned online professionals here in the country. Popsco was created para magkaroon yung mga student or uh, graduates of BJP, a community in which they can grow uh, their career as an online professional. They can get the support, the training, and the upskilling that they need in order for them to succeed and thrive as an online professional. So that's the So, uh, ang our Filipinos to become uh, successful in their online profession and also to have a sustainable source of living as an online freelancer. So, that's what pops for you. And uh, if you will join us, join the community, I, I assure you that um, your growth as an online professional will really um, be faster and also you have a community that you can lean on for support, for for help, and also if you want also to share your knowledge, skills, and experience as an online presenter, which is a very, very good venue for you, a very, very good community for you to do that as well. So that's what happens. Thank you. Ian, thank you so much, Sir Ian. Now I hope you're all fine there. I know that our um, guests tonight are quite busy. No, uh, they're actually in a separate um, meeting as well. So um, let me just open this. All right. So to tell us more about what is a freelancer cooperative and how you can join no, one um, freelancer cooperative. Um, please help me welcome no, Ms. Sherlane Fortunado, and she'll also discuss about the benefits and the duties of being a member of FAPSCO. All right, Ms. Sherlane, good afternoon po. Ah, good evening pala. <laughs> <laughs> Hi, good afternoon po. Good evening. Yes, <laughs> good evening sa inyo lahat. So I'll present now my team. Okay. Then sharing now. Can you see my screen? Uh, not yet po, ma'am. I think it's coming up. Still loading. Okay. Okay, so Hindi nakikita Okay I'll stop sharing Rush will be the one to share for the screen because it's not showing on my end. Okay. Magandang um, gabi po sa inyong lahat. So, ipapakita ko po ka ngayon kung ano po yung uh, i, uh, i discuss ko po sa inyo kung ano po yung cooperative. So, ang um, cooperative po is a firm owned control and operated group po mga kasapi ng kooperatiba, sila po ang nagmamayari. So, just any other cooperative, ang FAPS ko po ay ganun din po. Okay, so, eto po yung mga types of organization versus cooperative. So, meron din po kaming legal basis. Um, eto po yung legal basis, RA 6938, 9520, and 6939. Ang primary purpose po ng cooperative is service above profit. Okay, so ang basic requisite po ng to become a member is makigamitin yung mga services ng kooperatiba and willing to accept the responsibilities of members. So mamaya po, um, ami pong i-discuss kung ano po yung mga responsibilities and ng pagiging miyembro ng FAPSCO. Ang 
customer naman ang aming ding mga kamiyembro. And ang basis po ng voting, hindi po siya kagaya ng ordinary corporations na share of stock. Sa partnership naman po, equal voting. Sa amin po is one member, one vote, kagaya po ng other cooperative. Ibig sabihin po kahit gaano karami ang iyong share na ibinigay sa cooperative, one vote pa rin po ang iyong uh, maibibigay kapag nagbotohan. So, ito po yung components sa membership. Ang components of management is uh, mayroon, mayroon din po tayong BOD and hard management. So, ito po. Um, ang ROI po natin is limited and conforms with uh, government regulation. Hindi po kagaya ng ordinary corporation and partnership na no limit. And ito po yung principles ng cooperative. So, uh, siguro naman po ay wala po sa inyo na, na napilita na pumunta dito sa um, Google Meet na ito, di po ba? So, kasi po ang principles po ng cooperative, ang lahat na kooperatiba, dapat po is voluntary and open po for membership. And of course, democratic din po yung control. So members po ang nagko-control ng kooperatiba. And uh, participation, economic cooperation, co participation, uh, kailangan po yung mga miyembro ay mag-contribute po ng capital para, at nakakareceive din po sila ng dividends, meron din po patronage refund. And of course, the members also support the economic activities ng cooperative. And meron din pong autonomy and dependence. Okay? Then meron din pong educational and training and information. So, yung po mga training and education, yun po yung uh, kinakailangan na ibigay po ng cooperative dahil po nakasaad po yun sa CDA natin. Na ang mga cooperative, kailangan din po mag-train ang mga miyembro. Then, kailangan ang cooperative din po we can work with other cooperatives and we can join unions and federations. And meron din po tayong concern for the community. Kung makikita nyo po, kung miyembro po kayo ng other cooperative nitong pandemic, ma, ma, mapa, mapapansin nyo po na nag-share din sila sa community. Kagaya po ng sa Quezon, under po ako ng uh, ICDEC or uh, yung para pong pautangan para sa mga miyembro. So nakakuha din po kami ng something nitong pandemic. Kasi po, ang mga miyembro po or ang cooperativa may concern po sila sa community. Okay, so ito po yung mga practices ng cooperative. Kailangan po ang mga cooperativa, mayroon po silang capital formation. So makakakuha po sila ng capital formation pag nagbayad po ng membership fee. Tapos mayroon pong, syempre kapag kumita ang cooperativa, hindi nila ibinibigay lahat, kundi mayroon silang winiwild hope para po mas mapalago pa ang cooperativa natin. And of course, mayroon ding uh, cash trading, hindi po... Um, Puro po cash yung ibinibigay natin sa koreatiba. Hindi po tayo um, nagbibigay ng payment or services lamang na walang kaorupatang bayad. And selling in market market price to be sure that um, ang mga services natin or goods, if ever na may ino-offer na goods ang mga cooperative, ay um, namimaintain po yung prices ng goods natin para po uh, nakaprevail din po siya sa sa Daka yung po siya sa prevailing market prices. Okay, then constant expansion. Kung mala, makikita nyo po ang, ma, ang PAPSCO or any other cooperatives, palagi po silang uh, nag invite for new members to join. Kasi po, ang mga kooperatiba, dapat po sila ay may constant expansion para po sila ay mas lumaki at lumago. Then, kailangan po yung mga quality, ng may quality din po yung mga standard and services. And of course, Ito po yung mga tipo ng kooperatiba. Ang PAPS ko po ay service cooperative because we are online and uh, giving our services. Okay, then tayo po ay primary cooperative. Occupational po ang, ang ating, sorry, uh, and, and our capitalization, we have internal sources and capital. Ito po yung um, initial subscription na kung sakaling gusto nyo na mag-miembro ng kooperatiba, kailangan po mag-subscribe po kayo ng capital. At meron din pong continuous capital build up. And of course, kagaya ng any other cooperative, meron po din 
tayo membership. If ever na mayroon yung fine, tapos mayroon din po kaya nasa kooperatiyon. Okay. okay. So, share capital, meron po tayong authorized capital na ito ay nakastate sa articles of cooperative. Pero ito naman po ay payable within two years. So, hindi po siya masakit sa bulsa para sa ating mga miyembro. And paid up capital naman, ito yung initial payment na kailangan ibigay ninyo kung gusto mag... Okay, so mamaya po, i-discuss ko po sa ibigay nyo po uh, na kung gusto nyo makipag-miembro sa kooperatiba. Okay, thank you. Rosh? Ikaw. Mm -hmm. And Ma'am Sher Ma'am Sherlane. Yes, thank you po. I'm I'm done. All right. Salamat. Thank you so much po for sharing um to us what is uh a cooperative, no? Um considering that Fabsco is also a cooperative, but it is a cooperative for freelancers. Tama po ba? Okay. Po, tama, tama po. Maraming salamat po. Expressing that po. <laughs> Thank you so much, no, um, Ma'am Shirley, for sharing that. And uh, again, good evening po sa lahat na naka-tune in. Uh, ngayon lang nag-tune in um, via our Facebook Live and as well as here on our Google Meet. We understand po that um, you're trying to get in no, sa ating Google Meet room. However, due to limited capacity, we may uh, just um, uh, on board. Uh, a few. So just watch there na lang po sa ating Facebook Live and you will still be uh, eligible to get the certificates if you uh, fill out the attendance as well as the evaluation link posted on our comments section. All right. So to discuss about what a business center is and how to organize one, let's hear from Ms. Rochefel Rivera. Ms. Roche, the, the screen is yours po. Hi everyone, can you hear me? Yes. Yay, thank you. Mayang gabi, kan yung tanang? Mayang gabi. Gabi saya sa Ma'am Rosh. Gamay lang, gamay. <laughs> Guys, um, gusto ko lang medyo maging light tayo ng konti. So, uh, manghihingi ako sa inyo ng mga itatype niyo mamaya. May mga questions akong itatanong. Bigyan niyo lang ako ng numbers 1 and 2. Okay. One, kung naintindihan yung instruction ko. Two, kung hindi. Okay? Go ahead, please. Thank you, John Raziel. Raziel, Corsiga, Dante, Dudoy, thanks. John Angelo, John, thank you so much. Okay, start na tayo, ha? Maraming salamat. Okay, magkikwento lang ako what a business center is. Um, because FAPSCO was initially created, was initially inspired by the Digital Jobs PH training program, um, naisip namin na, Bakit hindi uh, magkaroon ng isang um, organization na susuporta sa bawat digital jobs PH classes? Kasi ang nangyayari, every time that a class um, graduates, nawawala yung mga freelancers na hindi nakakahanap ng trabaho kaagad. Siyempre, alam naman natin, mahirap ang buhay, especially nitong pandemic, di ba? So, so ang nangyayari, they go back to their original work, kung ano man yun, or they look for other opportunities. Sayang naman ang natutunan. Tama po ba yan o mali? Sino dito yung ngayon pa lang nag-iisip na baka hindi ko kaya miling? One, kung kayo yon Two, kung hindi. Oh, si, si Jovelyn nag-one agad. Nell Mir. Harold, one na agad. Bago pa lang, di ba? Carlito, two. Thank you. Jobert, one na agad. Lloyd, two. Very good. Okay, ganito. Totoo yan, kasi nararamdaman yan ng lahat ng mga graduate. Hindi kayo nag-iisa. The reason why um, we formulated, uh, we built the Business Center 
concept is para yung mga klase mismo coming from all parts of the Philippines. Kasi di ba iba't ibang provinces yung pinanggagalingan nyo. The reason why we built the business centers is para tatanggalin ko na, wala naman akong katabi. Nahirapan ako magsalita. Parang di akong makahinga. Wait lang. Sorry. <laughs> wala naman akong katabi, di ba? Okay. Ang sarap huminga eh. Masikip yung mask. Ulat. The reason why um, we created business centers para yung mga nakakaramdam na gusto na nilang mag-give up kahit pa paano merong susuporta sa kanila. Kasi let's face it, hindi ganun kadaleng makahanap ng trabaho online. At pag andun ka na sa, if you're on the verge of giving up, your friends, your team, your FAPSCO family will be there to support you. Kahit cheering squad na lang ang, 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 ang silbi namin, andyan pa rin kami para sa inyo. What else? Ano pa yung mga support ang pwede namin ibigay? Uh, meron tayong FAPS community. Ang tawag namin doon is FAPSCO, Filipino Online Professionals Community. It's a free Facebook group that you can um, look up right now. It's FAPSCO, type ko ha. Sa Facebook, hanapin nyo lang siya. It's um, composed of Filipino online freelancers na lagi namin constantly nagsishare kami ng mga job posts, ng mga opportunities, pati yung mga free webinars, free events. Nandyan namin lahat sinishare para sa mga non-members and we're giving it all for free. Now, what else? Bakit kayo kailangan magbuo ng business center? A business center is your own little family from your own province, from your own digital jobs PH class. For example, Dudu here is from Katbalogan. So if he can find at least five digital jobs PH graduates from Katbalogan City or uh, any freelancers na may experience na, may client na, if he can find just five composed of what? Manager, um, by, uh, assistant manager, secretary, treasurer, and auditor. Kung mas marami, mas maganda. Kung hindi, okay lang. Minimum of five, they can form a business center. Now, what does this business center do? Para kayong isang unit ng, ng grupo na nagtutulungan kung ano yung problema na nandyan sa inyo, sa loob, sa, sa, na malapit sa inyo. Kung for, for example, um, ang Katbalogan Freelancers Community, ang mga problema, hindi sila masyadong sanay maghanap ng kliyente, hindi sila sanay mag-converse sa client, makipag-negotiate. So, pwede namin kayong i-train further. Meron kayong mga free trainings. Or pwede namin kayong bigyan ng mga links kung saan kayong magtatrabaho. Meron din kami tinatawag na lead generation program na pagka nakahanap kayo ng leads, pag nakahanap ng leads doon, ibibigay yun sa mga business centers that have the skill that the client needs. So, in short, para siyang arm ng FAPSCO on a national scale level. Gets ba? Can you please give me a one if you understand? Okay. Thank you. All right. Um, sa ngayon, medyo marami-rami na yung mga business centers na nabubuo natin from Luzon, Visayas, and Mindanao. At ang unang-unang um, business center natin is from Mariveles. Okay? Um, gusto kong maintindihan nyo na ang FAPS ko hindi lang nandito uh, para sa, I mean, nandito para sa isang mission, which is to... Um, raise the bar of the Filipino online freelancing community. Yung uh, matuto tayong humanap ng sarili nating kliyente, syempre mas mataas, mas maganda. We can also train ourselves to become future leaders, future agency owners, depending on what we feel like it. Kasi hindi naman lahat uh, gusto yung maghanap ng trabaho. Yung iba gusto magtayo ng agency. Yung, isa gusto, iba gusto, yung iba gusto mag freelancing lang. So based on what we want, we support you on that matter. Okay? So, kung may tanong kayo later, hopefully if we still have time, itutuloy pa natin. Kaya lang sa ngayon, I have to give way to other um, speakers na mga susunod. Right? Thank you so much, Ma'am Rosh. It was indeed no nice to know that there is a community of freelancers helping out freelancers as well. Thank yeah. you, Dinef. Balik lang si Charlene Mabilis before the next speaker. Thank you. Sige po. Thank you so much. So those uh, who are watching on Facebook and are on our Google Meet, if you do have questions, part for Ms. Rochefell and the rest of the team about uh, may it be about uh, joining the cooperative or joining um, 
uh, a freelancing community no so park it uh, we will be uh, entertaining the questions after our last speaker all right so again uh, let's see po kung uh, buhay pa ba yung mga um, uh, joiners natin dito sa ano, sa Google Meet ayan shout out muna no to our um watchers from uh yeah la union ayan so pang national po tayo we also have sir romel roy watching from Car camarines sur good evening po sa inyo ayan so shout out ko lang din no um yung mga watchers natin from our facebook live no um Ms. Maria Sharina Semanya Diket, good evening po. And watching from Siniloan, Laguna. John Christian Valvi uh, Valdivia, good evening po. Ayan. So let's move on to our next speaker who will um, tell us about his experience or his testimony being a member of a business center or perhaps a member of um, FAPSCO. So let's give it up for Mr. Mark Esmana. Good evening, sir. The screen is yours. Hello, everyone. Hello, pa. Good so, evening. Kamusta naman kayo? Nakakatawa ng dami natin sa sa natin ngayon sa uh, Google Meet. So magbigay lang ako ng konting overview sa inyo. Um, product din ako ng DJT. Tapos uh, nag-training din ako. And right now, meron na tayong opportunity to train. <laughs> Ang hirap huminga ito yung nakalisig ko na. Ang hirap nga huminga saglit. So, nag, uh, dating na tayong produkto ng DJT na training sa amin. Ang, ang course namin noon before ay um, social media marketing. So, ang nakita ko before na problema ng mga freelancers ay unang-una, ang hirap talaga magkahanap ng trabaho. Agad-agad. So, parang ano yan, sortihan lang yan kung makahanap ka agad ng magandang kliyente. Pero may jackpot din talaga sa freelancing. Minsan, hindi pa nagsisimula yung, uh, I mean, kalahati pa lang na klase natin, minsan nakakakuha na ng, ng magandang kliyente. Pero hindi sa lahat ng pagkakataon ni ganun. So, yun yung minsan yung struggle ng isang freelancer. So, minsan nahihirapan ka talaga maghanap ng kliyente and the tendency ay mag-quit ka na. And um, second, so, ang nakikita ko rin na, na problema ng mga freelancers before ay yung mindset. So, minsan nag, nag-training tayo kasi nakita natin na aganto ah, pala, kailangan, kikita pala ako sa ganito malaki ang kitaan. Totoo, malaki yung kitaan. If you are only willing to to wait no, at willing kang magtsaga, doon papasok yung FAPSCO. Sa FAPSCO, yung community natin, uh, we are trying to, ano, hindi naman na pinap, laging pinapangako, pero we are trying to give opportunities online for other free, freelancers na pagtutulong-tulungan natin para para pare pareho tayo makahanap ng ng kliyente. And then sa mindset, so yun nakita ko sa mga uh, mga imagine kasama ko sa sa Fabs ko yung mga renowned freelancers exper experience na freelancers uh, across the Philippines. So yun yung nakita ko na goal na parang uh, uh, pwede ko rin ma-achieve yung mga ganitong bagay. So yun. So yun sa, uh, sa pagdating naman dun sa ano sa opportunities online, nagtayo nga kami ng business center sa Maribela sa after namin mag-training. And then, yung aming business center na yun, nag-create kami ng events. I think, uh, magkaroon kami ng Bataan Freelancers Forum. So, para matipon namin yung mga freelancers sa Bataan. And then, nag-hold kami ng um, Digital Revolution for SMS MSMEs. So, yung, yung huling uh, activity namin na yun para sa mga business owners. And from that event, nakakuha kami ng kliyente. At yung nakuha namin kliyente doon, pinagtulong-tulungan namin na trabahuhin ng mga member ng business centers. So that's the idea behind the business center. So kailangan magtutulong-tulungan tayo na bilang mga freelancers para makuha, makakuha tayo ng kliyente at kung ano yung makuha natin na kliyente, pagtutulong-tulungan natin sa trabaho. At syempre, kikita tayo dun sa project na yun. So yun yung naging journey ko uh, as a proof na kung gaano nakatulong sa akin ang isang um, freelancing community. And thank you. Sana kung meron kayong uh, more uh, questions lang, feel free to send us a message on our page, Fapsco, Fapsco PH. So, yun. 
Ayan, thank you so much, Sir Mark. It's mana no. Um, plug ko lang din no for those who are not familiar with the DJ DJT or the Digital Jobs uh, PH Technical Training of Department of Information and Communications Technology. Ito po yung free training na binibigay po namin, especially to the rural. Um, communities na um, marami tayong talents na pwedeng maging online freelancers. So what the ICT provides are um, free training for these individuals who are unemployed, yung mga underemployed or mga OFWs na na-displaced po, especially at this time no, na pandemic. As well as we also give opportunities for PWDs and um, single moms. So Better check out no uh, on the Facebook pages of your uh, of your respective um, DICT clusters near you. So uh, to check on the schedules of the courses of DJT that they will be offering this year. No, so kasagaran kasi ng mga ano natin ng mga um, people who are members of FAPSCO are also graduates of DJT. No, isa na ako nun, uh, Way back in 2017, Zamboanga Batch. All right. So thank you so much, Sir Marcus Mana. And now to share as well, no, um, uh, to share now what is the FOPSCO Academy? Now, what can you get from this um, institution? Now, let's all welcome Sir Jay Balan. Sir Jay. Hello. Uh, good evening. Good evening. Yes, pa. Good evening, pa. Hi, hi. Okay, so good evening sa inyo lahat. Um, uh, I'm Jay. I'm actually a uh, member of the Education Committee ng PAPSCO. And uh, we have uh, a PAPSCO Academy, which actually the one of our uh, projects that uh, we, we want to, uh, know, we want to promote. Kasi it's a PAPSCO Academy, we, we actually invited experts experts into their skills actually may, may sino ba si, sino ba dito sa inyo ang uh, gustong maging SEO or social or social media marketing or uh, web designer or uh, digital marketing actually yung mga yon yung mga ganong skills are being discussed uh, used through ano uh, through Popsco Academy and uh, we also, uh, aside from that, uh, na, na discussed ni, ni Miss Rodina, na we are uh, the the members of uh, the Pasco com community are actually experts then or trainers with their respective skills. Na kami yung kami rin yung mga naggumagawa ng training. Actually, kaya kami nandito ngayon is because we're doing the training uh, assessment ng mga modules namin before for 2021 and the, and the, yun ang mga ginagawa namin sa PAPSCO and there are future projects that we are uh, doing like meron kami mga e-learning uh, sites na, na na you can join if you're uh, going to be a member of PAPSCO na pwede kang mag-join ng mga e-learning uh, ano namin so you just have to be a member and sign in and you can get all the modules the training materials na makakapag-enhance ng skills mo if you want to become a freelancer. So, uh, the future is bright for freelancers. Sabi nga, uh, it will be the, fu the future of work uh, in, in the years to come. Actually, nagsisimula na nga siya. Karamihan ay uh, na-work from home na. So, why not learn new skills? And uh, Pafsco can help you with that. And together, sabi nga, we, we, we are family, to go, together we grow, no? And uh, so from there, so pwedeng kum kumita ng dollar, kumita ng euro, kumita ng peso. So and anything that you want to earn, uh, uh, I'm sure, no, with, the, with, the, with our uh, learning uh, academy and then uh, those things that yeah, we, are in, we are working on in the future, uh, there will be a fruitful and a bright full future for all of us. Okay, thank you, Rodina. Thank you so much, Sir Jerem uh, Jay, right? Yep. Uh, <laughs> Ayan, so Sir <laughs> Jay din po ay isa po sa mga, um, mga best trainers po Salamat. natin sa DJT. Thank you so much, Sir mm -hmm. Jay. Ayan, so bago tayo mag-move on sa ating next na speaker, 
let's check uh some of our um uh, joiners, no? let's give a shout out to our uh, freelancers as well na andita sa ating Google Meet Room. Hello po, kina Jackal Sale from Pasay City as well as from si Miss uh, Louis Blair Garcia watching from Nueva Ecija and as well as Sir Christian Ray Doctolero no? from Pangasinan po. Ayan. So may may I know po um, sino po dito ang mga my clients na po sa ating um, mga joiners or um, if you are still uh, aspiring uh, an aspiring freelancer or you're currently um, handling clients para makita po natin no ayan okay all right so i think um we're all set for our next speaker i know um this is just a one hour webinar no, so we will um, maximize the time that we have. And uh, no worries, then uh, Popsco has a Facebook page, which uh, you can message anytime and see their posts as well. All right, so let's hear from Ms. Jane Maghanoy about her testimony of being a member of um, the Popsco community. Ms. Jane? And Ms. Rush, is Ms. Jane um, hopping in? Yes, hold on. Uh, I'm going to work on mic. Okay, Hi, everyone. Good evening. Good evening, Pa, Ms. Hello. Jane. Okay. Am I clear, ba? I'm clear na. Yes po. Okay, got it. Ayan, maayong gabi sa inyong tanandira. And um, it's nice to be here, no? So, um, ano ba yung naging benefits with me when it comes to a member? Ang alam po kasi, um, parang ano naman to eh. When I started, by the way, when I started my freelancing, that was actually 12 years ago, no? So, it was only me and Google alone. So, kami lang magka-partner. But through all, all these years, one, there's one thing that I've learned very important that you are going to build relationship with other freelancers because building that relationship can actually help you grow instead na ikaw lang yung uh, ikaw lang yung um, ikaw lang um, it really helped me a lot to connect with other fellow freelancers okay so that's the number one benefit that i've got joining the pops uh, community second thing um so my goal to join the Fox Co is that I wanted to have that extra in uh, extra para in a way it, it, it serves as um it serves as uh, parang kumbaga, uh, for me to save a little bit of my income because somehow there's a membership for this one so para may may lang ako. But that actually with that goal that actually turned me into um like um somehow parang nagkaroon ng return of investment kumbaga. You know why? Because um, through that an opportunity, uh, through by, by joining the member, uh, the, the FOFSCO, is that it actually gave me an opportunity of number one, it gave me referrals. So there are fellow freelancers na nagre refer sa akin na, hey, Jane, there is this client who might be interested with SEO. So, ayan, may bibigay sa akin yung opportunity na yan to get potential client. Okay? And then from there, um, at the same time, and all, because of that uh, joining membership, I also become part of the uh, DGT assessors that again is also an opportunity for me um an opportunity for me to share my knowledge about uh, about my uh, freelancing skills okay and then more than that one i'm joining i know um, another thing that benefits is that for example if you are aspiring um to outsource some projects uh, with pag madami na kayong clients it's, it's very easy actually to get um, to get yung someone na makakatulo and yung ano um you are very sure you are very guaranteed na they are someone who can help you with your freelancing gigs in that way again it will give you more opportunities of uh getting more ano pa freelancing gigs and the fourth one is um actually joining joining the Fopsco community is actually um, um it's about really about adding value to people because through the Fopsco community it can all it also ano no parang in a way, it helped me mas nag-widen pa yung, yung ano, uh, um, parang yung value or parang yung opportunity for me um, 
again to share to other people um, about freelancing and it's also about um, sharing more about yung ano um helping um the philippines create uh, jobs in the countryside so i think um that covers yung lahat ng mga um so far for me uh, when it comes to joining the popsco membership Okay, so All right. It. Thank you so much, Ma'am Jane Maghanoy, no? uh, one of the trainers and assessors for DJT as well, and a successful member of the FOPSCO community. Thank you so much. Okay. So um, I see now, we have mga freelancers dito sa ating Google Meet. Um, we have Nico Magalona, content writer from freelancer.com. Hello. And uh, as well as our aspiring freelancers who are joining for us uh, with us today. Ayan. Now, lastly, we have one more um, who will share his uh, experience and his testimony being a member of the FAPSCO. Um, let's all welcome no, Sir Dennis Pagio. Sir Dennis? Hello, good evening. Good evening, Pa. All right, so Ms. Rudina, can you hear me properly and loud? Yes, po? Pa, loud and clear. Thank pa. you, thank you. All right, so, sino ba dito sa inyo ang sawana? <laughs> that would be my open question. Sawana sa pagiging empleyado. Kasi that was my triggering moment uh, kung bakit ko hinanap kung saan ba talaga, kung ano ba talaga yung purpose ko. So, um, sige, to give you a short um, journey, um, after ng high school, uh, nag-working student na ako because gusto ko talaga ituloy yung pag-aaral ko. So, nag-work ako sa Jollibee and uh, call center and accounting clerk for two years. And then the last job that I had was in pharmacy industry for five years. So, medyo maaga ako na-expose when it comes to employment. So after that, um, di ba nag five years ako sa pharmacy industry. That's the time na I think I had enough when it comes to my employment status. So nag-resign ako without knowing kung ano yung next step ko. Kung baga ang alam ko lang noon was there is a place na hinahanap ko kaya lang hindi ko alam kung saan yun at ano yun. So what I did was I start investing myself. Paano ba? Nag-invest ako through learning those things na hindi ko pa ginagawa, hindi ko pa na natatry, at hindi ko pa na-experience. So, nag-start ako by acquiring new um, um, courses sa mga TESDA. Kung baga talaga nag-aral ako ng um, cake decoration, bread and pastry, um, commercial baking, auto mechanic, and what else? Uh, bookkeeping, so lahat yun. Talagang tuloy-tuloy na pag-aaral ko until such time na nakita ko yung opportunity na ino-offer ng RIS, which is now the uh, DJT or what we called the Digital Jobs Training. So what I had was the e-commerce or the digital marketing and e-commerce. Yung gagawa ka ng website and at the same time you're going to market it. So in short, um, that was the window pagdating sa freelancing or what we call the online professional industry ngayon. So, hindi ko lang akalain na yun lang pala yung door na magbubukas sa akin sa mas malaking opportunity, sa mas malawak na na yun na pala yung place na hinahanap ko. Na hindi ko akalain na I was a trainee before and now I am a trainer or one of the DJT trainer. So, I really want this to share this story of myself because alam ko, katulad nyo rin ako, na you are just waiting for the right time and then for the right chance na mapunta kayo sa place na hinahanap nyo. And that training was the best decision na inatinan ko na my guts in life is itry ko yung mga bagay na hindi ko pa nagagawa. It can be food, adventure, learning, or kung ano man yung gusto kong itry na hindi ko pa natatry. So, I really want you to experience or always have that excitement in yourself. Kasi pag may excite ka, that's where the life goes with yourself. Kung baga, andun yung excitement, lagi kang happy, lagi kang hype. Kasi dapat naman talaga may experience natin lahat. Alright, to cut the story short, balik tayo. So, what I've learned from that training is, um, I'm sure lahat sa inyo dito is um, nasa TJT training. 
but then um, some of you are upskilling, acquiring new skills, and freelancers na. So it's okay that uh, you had that training because that training is the best time for you to commit mistake. Kumbaga, okay lang yun because everything that you experience is a learning process. Kasama yun. When you commit mistake, you learn from it. Okay lang yun. And then another one is pagdating sa ating sa freelancing, hindi naman talaga madali makapasok just like what uh, Sir Mark said na hindi ka agad jackpot ka. Uh, I don't believe in luck. Kasi sa totoo lang, yung luck, para lang yun sa mga tao talaga na nagsusumikap until such time na yung fruit ng kanila pinahirapan is, ayan na, that's the, process, that's, the, that's the result, that's the fruit of their uh, labor, sabi nga nila. So, I want you to always uh, focus doon sa gusto nyong hanapin yung place kung saan kayo may value, kung saan nyo naramdaman kung saan kayo may halaga, kung saan nyo naramdaman na pinapakinggan kayo and at the same time uh, dun nyo may bibigay yung best of yourself okay so that's where i am so i hope um the, the reason why i am here in this particular position here in fasco or the filipino online professional service cooperative because this is my way of paying forward doon sa binigay sa akin ng opportunity ni djt or what we call the digital jobs training na ito na yung kumbaga makapag-inspire ako ng kapwa ko mga hoping and waiting for that right chance, for that right opportunity na makuha yung what is the freelancing all about. So with that, um, now I handle the FAPSCO Academy. So I want you to know that FAPSCO Academy, it's, um, we air that every Tuesdays of sa FAPSCO FB page at 7 p.m. And also for Fabstock, um, sa Fabstock every Wednesdays, uh, pinipicture namin yung mga success stories ng mga uh, katulad namin from trainee to trainer and yung mga success stories ng mga freelancers. And by the way, the Fabsco Academy is also for uh, for those uh, what do you call this courses or training na gusto nyo matutunan. If you are here, if you can hear me loud and clear. Pa-type po dito sa chat box, also for our FB Live viewers, yung mga gusto nyong mga courses na i-feature namin sa Popsco Academy. Because personally, I handle the Popsco Academy. So kung ano mang ita-type nyo mga courses, that would be my basis of my upcoming episodes na i-feature natin. And it's for free. It's for free namin binibigay. Sige, i-type nyo lahat ng gusto nyong matutunan dyan. As I am uh, seeing on the chat box, uh, sabi ni um, Raymond uh, Sepron, sabi niya web development na ang ating offer. Why not? Okay, so just go with it and then it's up to you kung anong courses na gusto nyong or training na gusto nyong matutunan tapa. pa. Because of course, Popsy Academy is for upskilling, exploring, and acquiring new skills. So I guess without further ado, nasabi ko na gusto kong sabihin. Okay, so yung iba sabi kasi nila gusto na mag-start freelancing. But yes, Uh, thank you very much. In behalf of Popsco Academy, um, we also handle the Popsco Academy, uh, Popsco Media rather. So when it comes to the back end or behind the scenes of Popsco Academy and Popsco, kami din po yun sa Popsco Media. So without further ado, please, um, Ms. Rudina, please take the presenter's mic. Ang dami ko na yata sinabi. Thank you very much, guys. <laughs> <laughs> thank you so much, yes, Sir Dennis. Thank you. No? <laughs> All right, my question po, Sir Dennis. Yes, nahanap please. mo na po yung place mo sa FAPSCO. Nahanap mo na po ba yung forever mo? Naksi, yes. Uh, I would say yes because um, I am here in Filipino Online Professional Service Co Cooperative because uh, this is, yung masasabi ko talaga na forever and my advocacy na makatulong din sa mga kapwa ko freelancers that are just waiting for the right time and right opportunity. Thank you, Ms. Redina. Please take the presenter's mic. Ayan, na sweet naman. So, Sir Dennis, thank you so much for your words, na. Um, so, you guys already have insights on how FOPSCO has changed not only these three people's lives, but so many others, right? No? So, um, so um, 
I just also want to share, no, uh, as well, no, um, to those who are aspiring uh, to be freelancers, no. Uh, the government has so much in store for you. It's just um, on you, no, to reach out or to avail of the services that the government gives us for free. Ayan, thank you so much. Ayan, sa ating mga sharers uh, um, from the FAPSCO community as well as, no, um, may mga uh, comments tayo dito, no, that they want, no, animation and video editing. Um, Miss Rush, would that be... Um, or any anybody from the FAPSCO community, um, would that be one or a couple of the courses that you may offer for free to Noted our community? <laughs> okay, so meron din po tayong fashion product photography daw, Sir Dennis or Ma'am Raj. So if pwede po, so just make sure to check the page po of FAPSCO. It's been on, uh, it's actually on our chat panel and as well as on the comment section sa ating live po sa DICT. Again, thank you so much, everyone. Now, we are opening the floor for questions that you may have, no? So, My feel free to um, <laughs> type in your questions to our uh, guest speakers and uh, to those who also have or may want to ask for advice no sa ating successful freelancers um, who are members of the community so please type in your questions or feel free to um unmute yourselves if you have a couple of questions or perhaps we can entertain at least uh, three or three to five but we still have a couple minutes so let's uh, check on muna po yung um comment section natin sa sa ano sa the ICT live, ayan. Dami request, ha ha ha, by Miss Raquel Castro. Hi, Miss Raki. Hi, Miss Raquel Castro. Enjoy watching. <laughs> watching po siya from Facebook Live, ayan. So, meron, uh, I think in demand po yung video editing, no? Um, Sir, Sir Denise, pa, yes. pa check na po yan sa ano niyo, sa listahan niyo. Sa on your request. Ayan. Thank you so much. As well as, meron po din po tayo request to have project management, no? I think CC na CC yan sa ating FAPSCO members. Okay. So, may we entertain your questions? Okay. So, meron po uh, question. I'm not sure if this is related, no? Sa, sa um, topics we discussed. But uh, Gerald has a question. What is the forecasting? and creating great leads for clients po. Um, anybody from the FAPSCO community can address. Ano po ba yung forecasting in creating great leads or getting great leads for clients as per your experiences? Anybody from our FAPSCO community? Ayan. So, ipark muna natin yung question mo, Gerald, ha? Um... We also have one question now from our um, watchers. Now, so a uh, question is, uh, I'm not sure if this was discussed, but how can they uh, join the community, uh, the um, cooperative? Mamrosh? Okay, sige ako na lang. Um, okay, go. How to join sub? Uh, Popsco, as long as you have the skill or one of the skills of being in an only professional or being a freelancer, so pwede ka na mag-join and of course, you should be 18 years old above. So kahit anong skills na meron ka. And of course, yung nag-graduate sa atin sa digital jobs training, automatic yun. They have that skills na na-acquire nila from that particular training that they had. Pwede Ayan. sila. Thank Welcome so much. and enjoy some sa uh, do they have to uh, message or will there will there be a form that they'll have to fill out all right so that uh thanks for asking miss redina actually they just have to go to papsco.ph and then nakalagay dun yung link na uh, apply membership uh let me just send to you the link papsco.ph Okay, so check nyo po tong link na to, uh, the, the registration um, button. I think it's there. Yep. Or let me share my screen. 
okay. para mag-guide okay. natin sila how to apply as a member in FAPSCO. So here, presenting. Okay. Can you see my screen? Yes, Pop. What can you see, please? Can we, uh, uh, Google Tabs. All right. So let me just go to fabsco.ph. So once that you are there, let me just wait for the loading of our website. So here, as you can see, are you looking for guidance in your freelancing journey? So we are here to guide you. And when it comes to freelancing, kailangan lang talaga merong kang taong matatanungan when it comes to your journey sa freelancing. So here, as you can see, join now. Just click this particular button, join now, and then uh, mag-guide na kayo how to apply or how to become a member of the Filipino Online Professional Service Cooperative. As you can see here, the qualifications are you should be a Filipino, at least 18 years old. Of course, uh, you have the capacity to to contract or to read the contract, uh, the details of everything, and within a common bond and field of membership. Kumbaga, pare-parehas tayo sa freelancing or online professional industry. And here, must be an online professional, freelancer, or basta grumaduy ka ng training na pinuduce or binigay ni DICD or kahit freelancer ka na hindi ka naman talaga grumaduy from a training, pwede kang maging member at welcome ka when it comes to FAPSCO. Go on. Thank you, Ms. Rubina. Please take the presenter's mic. Go ahead. Thank you for your answer, Sir Dennis. May, uh, one more question po. I'm not sure who, who of you guys can address. Um, how to be a trainer po? Kailangan po ba na college graduate or my degree? Yes po. Uh, from our free uh, FAPSCO community, guys, since um, most of you are um, all on the DJT training as trainers um, and assessors. So my question po, tara, pinim lang po ng isang kasama namin. Yeah. Okay. Si Sir Merlin sasagot. Go ahead, sir. Go ahead, Sir Merlin. Hi, po. Good evening. <laughs> Support. Go ahead. Ayan. Hello. Hello, sir. Hi, Dina. Good evening sa inyong lahat. Yes, po. Ano yung tanong? Ano yung tanong? Uh, yung tanong po is paano po oh. maging trainer and paano kailangan trainer? mo pa college graduate? Well, uh... Dati kasi ni-require namin na college graduate. Pero ang basis namin ng, ano, ng uh, isang pagiging trainer ay ang importante ay dapat ay siya ay isang freelancer. Mm -hmm. Tapos ay may experience na o oh, medyo not necessarily matagal na siyang freelancer pero at least alam niya kung paano niya. Yung, yung buhay ng isang freelancer kasi ang titrain nga natin ang titrain natin ay yung mga magiging freelancer, di ba? Yes. That's for the digital jobs page. Alright. But then, uh, siyempre kailangan may may knowledge na rin siya ng mga ng mga titrain, ba? Yung mga gagawin ng training dapat alam niya yung courses, alam niya yung modules, that's why uh, for this year, before before tayo mag-roll out ng training, uh, starting second quarter of this year, magkakaroon muna tayo ng Digital Jobs PH training for trainers. TOT, so training if you want to apply, if you want to apply, uh, mag-send kami ng uh, link para sa 2021 application for digital job space. Okay? Yeah, very, very informative po, Sir Merlin. Thank you, Dina. Yeah. Thank you so much, Sir Merlin, and regards to all no, sa, sa group niya dyan. Ayan, so nasagot na po ni Sir Merlin, there will be a tr uh, training of trainers for digital jobs. So abang-abang po tayo dyan, we will be posting the link po on our DICT pages on how you can join uh, the Ay, center. Dina, sa, na schedule namin yan ang, ang training of trainers uh, last week 
of March. Last week online of March. Yan, online. Okay. All right. Thank you so much, Sir Merlin. Okay. So I think we're all pumped up and all set. You know, if you want to know more about the digital jobs, technical training, and other initiatives of the ICT, please check on uh, our chat panel, uh, the link to uh, my channel. And that's actually my channel. And I've collated um, a few of the training and um, a lot of... Uh, a number of DICT initiatives that you can actually take advantage for free. Ayan, so I think we're all done. So thank you so much sa ating sharers. This uh, for tonight, no? uh, very informative. Again, check out the Facebook page of Popsco to know more about uh, joining the community of these freelancers who are helping each other grow. Ayan, so to close tonight's event, may we call on um, Ms. Jahan Foro to give her message and a few pointers about FOPSCO. All right, Je, take it away. Hi, Ms. Dina. I miss you. Hi everyone, good evening. Um, I'm Jehan Foro, the business center manager for Zamboanga City um, Fabsco Business Center. Um, before we close out the program, I would like to first discuss a few things about the you know, how to become a member. Um, I believe this was a question posted earlier. And also for for the comments kanina sa, um, sa presentation ni Sir Dennis, um, about the trainings, yung mga nabanggit ninyo na uh, web development, web design, graphics design, SEO. These are all courses offered by the Digital Jobs Technical Training. And these are all the courses that we are all working on. Um, at the moment, we will be working on all of these courses until um, Thursday. Para upgraded siya, updated lahat ng information that the training will provide for this year, 2021. And we also want to make sure that the graduates that we uh, we produce on the digital jobs technical training are all um, highly skilled at I know, um, pwedeng pwedeng mag compete in the world market. So that's uh, that's kaya magkakasama kami dito lahat. And just for everybody's information po, lahat kami nag test, nag swab test po kami at nag negative po kami lahat. So kaya pwede kami mag work without masks. Just in case. Um, magkaroon ng, ano, okay? So, uh, let me just present um, the slides for how to become a member of FOPSCO. Okay. So, nabanggit na ni Sir Dennis kanina, you go, just go to our website. There is a membership form there that you can fill out. So, that will be this one, membership and subscription agreement. Uh, and also, once you fill that out, um, you also have to pay the membership fee. So the membership fee, uh, the initial payment will be 2,000 pesos. And so 2,000 pesos na yun, 1,000 pesos is the membership fee. And uh, 1,000 pesos is the initial share capital, meaning um, you'll get 10 shares um, of Fopsco at 100 pesos per share. And um, we're currently still working on the uh, subscribed share which is a minimum of 50 shares payable in 24 months. So, hindi pa to siya masyado implement as of the moment. So, ito lang yung kailangan ninyong bayaran, 2,000 pesos. And ito, these are the membership payment options. So, uh, you can pay 2,000 pesos in uh, oh, upfront. So, uh, we have, what do we have, Shirls? Gcash, BDO, right? So Gcash and BDO, uh, you can send your payment through those uh, payment um, links. Or uh, you, if you don't have the capacity yet to pay it up front, you can also pay in installments of 500 pesos per month. Um, and you have three options, right? Three months, three months, four months, and six months. So yeah, you, uh, if you choose the installment option, you, you can choose between three months four months or six months. So for three months, you have three months to complete the payment of 2,000 pesos or kung gusto nyo sagarin hanggang six months, um, as long as makomplete nyo siya within that time period, um, you'll be eligible na to become regular members of the FOPSCO community. And then uh, you can also choose to uh, have the deferred payment. So for example, you uh, fill out the form and mag-member kayo ngayon, um, you can 
Um, tapos nagkaroon kayo ng work through FOPSCO. Kasi from time to time, we, we roll out jobs for our members kasi. So, pag naging member kayo and um, associate member yung tawag sa inyo kasi wala po kayong payment and then you get a job, you can also choose um, to have a certain amount deducted from your salary um, monthly or depending na rin sa inyo kung ano yung ano, um, payment schedule hanggang sa mabuo ninyo yung 2,000 pesos. Okay, I hope that answers the question of how to become a member. And na-discuss naman na ng lahat ng mga fellow FOPSCO members ko kung ano yung um, benefits, advantages, testimonials, and everything. Um, we wouldn't all be here if hindi kami super committed to, to, to the community and to the service that we want to provide to the freelancers. So all I can say right now is um, we will welcome anybody who comes into our community to join us so that we can all grow together. Uh, with that, thank you so much for this uh, wonderful opportunity to share who we are at FOPSCO. And thank you, Ms. Tina. Hope to see you again soon. Thank you so much, Ms. Jehan Foro, the ever-beautiful BC head of Zamboanga FAPSCO. All right. So thank you so much, everyone, for staying with us tonight no, on our webinar. And as well as thank you to the FAPSCO peeps who shared their um, time no, for um, their insights for our freelancers who are watching. Thank you so much. Don't forget to check on the evaluation link posted on the comment section on our Facebook Live. And don't forget as well to fill it out. Now, for those who are in the Google uh, Meet room, it's already in the chat panel. Um, certificates for this webinar will be released within two to three weeks after today. And make sure that you fill out correctly, uh, especially po yung email addresses nyo. Uh, make sure that these are correct. Ayan. So thank you so much again for more information about FOPSCO and um, their initiatives as well as on uh, the, the free training and free opportunities that they they can give you check out their facebook page fopsco it's it's also in our comments section again thank you so much everyone and uh, you all have a great evening maayong gabi sa inyo damo nga salamat maayong gabi damo salamat dagat salamat bye bye thank you hinay la kampirmi